I'm Wim Crowell. I have an exhibition in the Design Museum at the moment. And uh, we are looking now at a beautiful room here in the Andes Hotel with typefaces in the back, typeface on the floor and the carpet. This is coming from my early typefaces. And Tony Brook, the designer who designed also the exhibition, he designed the wallpaper. He made it a three-dimensional typeface. And my typeface was two-dimensional. So to give it a, a kind of atmosphere of space, three-dimensional outlook. Uh, I have always done in my work some three-dimensional uh, images, and uh, especially graphic design without using perspective, having a, an idea of space. And Tony Brook translated that whole idea very much, very well, with a, with a simple C of my name and making a three-dimensional image out of it. And then uh, one of the other experimental typefaces is done in a, in, a, in a carpet here on the floor. This typeface is done for the early digitization of typefaces. I was in an exhibition of print and paper in 1964 in Germany, and I saw the first digital typeface producer, and the products that came out of it were horrible. It was so horrible that I thought you should design a special typeface for the digital era. The exhibition in the museum, there are some chapters in it. A very important chapter is the work for the Van Abbe Museum in Eindhoven. It's a museum of modern art, and I worked for that museum in the 50s. And the director became director of the Stedelijk Museum in Amsterdam later. So in the 60s and 70s and 80s, I did all the catalogs and posters for that museum. And that's the main body, the, the strongest body in the exhibition. I have always tried to um, be a designer, a no-nonsense designer. Uh, straightforward, and uh, no Baroque, no, no fantasies. Straightforward, readable, and good uh, structured typography. That's what I wanted to do, and I hope that they will remember me as a designer who was straightforward and uh, still trying to find uh, some tension in the work to have work that is recognizable.